TG Weekly, episode 47. Put that Bret Hart clip in there. Yeah, that'd be a good one. Episode 47, which is, I don't know if I can do it. Fernando? Johnny Cueto. Johnny Cueto. Johnny Cueto's cool. ATG stamp of approval on Johnny Cueto. Johnny Cueto, he's a legend in oh. land. He's fun. He is fun. He is fun. He's a little pudgy too, which <laughs> I don't think he's the tallest guy either. I don't either. Like I don't think he's he's quite six foot. He's a good pitcher. Had some injury issues as of late. Yeah, he's I'd say he's that solid like number three guy now. He is he? now. He was a stud with Eat some innings. A stud with Cincy. A couple good starts with the rolls and the playoffs, it's all that mattered, and I got that ring. Um, well, what do we got going on? The usual. Regular season has concluded. Regular season has concluded. Season five. We will talk about that when we kick it to the green screen over there. Um, you got some, you found some more cards. We did find some cards yesterday. Walmart is back in stock. Walmart, Tuscaloosa. We, uh. Nothing. I ordered from Card Barrel yesterday the two cards we were missing. Beautiful. And I ordered like a hundred commons of, from 73 tops that we were missing. Ooh. It gets a little sketchy when you get into the high numbers, the fives and the 600s. Uh, it's a little more rare. But it's going to take, uh, keep chipping away at it. We got that Schmidt. Yeah. We got, I think we got all the big stars except for. Pete Rose. We got Pete Rose. We got Hank. We got all the stars except Roberto. Mays. And Mays are the big ones. Maze is at that antique shop still. Might have to go get that one. Here, like a 20% off sale. So, we got that. What do you got going? Uh, no. I don't know. We, uh, should we go cook? We should go cook. We're gonna go cook. It's your daily recipe in. Recipe of the week. Recipe of the week. Maybe some other, some, some other things. Let's saunter. Saunter. Gallivant. Gallop. That was a pretty cool move. Gallop. Joey Gallop. Come on, horses. Play horse. horses. Play horses. Playing horses. Alright. Should we go to the kitchen? We should go to the kitchen. See you in the kitchen. Cakes and tasty steaks. Tasty Sizz cakes. Sizzling steaks. Sizzling and tasty cakes. Sizzling cakes and tasty cakes. Smoked meats. What? Smoked beef every day. Smoked beef. Oh. Every day. You what know, do we got? We stopped at Walgreens and got two of the. What the hell are these? Baseball Prime Pack. Yeah, one hobby pack plus one bonus card inside. They were Fairfield boxes. I think these are Fairfield too. Yeah. Just Baseball Collector's Edge. Look for randomly inserted inserts, cards, packs, parallels, autographs, and more. One and eight contain a hit. One and eight contain a hit. Well, we love cracking rats. We do. In the past, <clears throat> we have pulled some big autos out of these. Big autos by big autos you mean... Mid 2000s Marlins <laughs> prospects. Like, who have you got before? Ricky Nolasco and Chris Volstad. 
they had goodish years along the way. Yeah, I'm not amazing. I think but... they had another guy that was a Canadian. Chris uh, Reed? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so we've, we've... I mean, pulling autos out of these is pretty good. Yeah. Um, well, let's crack them. We're going to crack them. We're going to cook something up, too. We are going to cook something up. And let's take go fast forward to that, and I'll let these dogs out that are whining. Mm -hmm. And right. we will crack these rats. Cracking the rats. Wipe screen. And we're back. Packs have been ripped and cracked. Cracked! Cracked! What packs we open? We had, out of this one, came with 1992 edition series one of Leaf Set Baseball. I had the same pack in mind. And then two blue boxes came with a top series one pack of from 2019. And then I think you said this was 15? 15 Donruss. 15 Donruss. 15 Donruss. It's a hobby pack. Right. Nothing, nothing. What do you bring? Our to recipe the for today. Right there. It was a Dane quesadilla. It was a Dane quesadilla. Cooked up, oh, cooked up in the microwave for like a mm. like a minute, fifteen. Mm. Chopped up and served on some some fine paper plates. Real Sargento cheese, um, and the big ass Mission tortillas. I don't think they weren't moldy, so I'm gonna garnish mine a little bit of Frank's Red Hot. Roll that up. We just had we just had Chick Fil A breakfast. We did just have Chick Fil A. That's a rise for the. Mmm. That's a Dilla. But dang, quesadilla. Shout out to Heisman O2. Mmm. He's a fan of the eats. He likes the eats. That shiny head of his. You're a good man, Michael Lopez. Mi hermano. Um, what was I saying? You're going to start off with the card. So we have a bunch of cards. We do have a bunch of cards. Then, the best card, hi dogs, the best card that I got was out of the 92 Leaf. It was, was kind of cool. Not worth a bunch. A bunch. It's going for, uh, looks like between two and eight on Sue MC, eBay, who knows. A 92 Flip, uh, Leaf Pedro Martinez with the Dodgers. Uh, it was like gold rookie or something. That's pretty fresh. I like that card. Start off with a upper deck vintage from 02. 02. Uh, Sean Casey on the Reds. The man! And a pretty much reversed 71 tops design. I don't know how the hell they got away with that. The backs are even the same. Same design. That is weird. Yeah. Just put the top of the bottom. Upper uh, deck didn't care. Um, we won't do like a hundred cards. Let me pick another one. Uh, uh, I'll go with this. This was in the big weird hanger box. It's a 1990. I don't know two or one upper deck diamond skills. It's Barry Bonds and Andy Van Slyke. They took time, I think, to pose together. I think they, uh, I think they hate each other back then. Van Slyke. Van Slyke showed those pictures, or those commercials with Frank Thomas. Oh, he's he's old buff, buff old guy. I feel stronger. Um, crushing oh, my work. Suck it in. I think for a time, there was a couple years there where Van Slyke was viewed as the best overall player in baseball. When Bonds was probably the best player in baseball yeah. at the time, but. Van Slyke was getting some love for a period of about two years. He was like, he can do it all. He's five tools. Anyway, there's those two together. Pirates. But, uh, 2019 Jeff McNeil rookie was a cool. That's the best one out of the, out of the 19. 19 tops. Followed him up with the Justice Sheffield rookie. He hasn't really blown up yet. I think no rookies really worth a damn in my 19. Um, Rex Hudler out of the Leaf Pack. And, uh, what is this, 84? Here you go, doggies. 86, Come here, doggies. 87. Come here. 87, George Bell. Come here, doggies. Doby. Nova. Come here. No, come get it. No, Doby's like, I don't want that hot sauce, man. 
And I was like, I do. Um, 52, Eddie Matthews. Felix Hernandez. Insert. Iconic card. Insert. Um, bunch of junk wax. Yeah, these cards are, these packs are always just the weirdest mm. combination of 80s cards and 90s junk wax. cards. And not like five bucks. Cards. Definitely not. Kenny's book value anyone? worth five bucks, but it scratched that itch. Excuse me. Jerry Reed, he's a catcher. He's also like a country singer. Is he? I think he was in Smokey and the Bandit. That mustache. Way before your time. You know the movie Smokey and the Bandit? You know the name. Yeah, driving around in a... That mustache. Burt Reynolds driving around in a Trans Am with Sally Field. Ron Ventura. Beat up by Nolan there. Ryan. Yeah. It's the same on his car. Man, I love that Nolan Ryan. What a... Uh, that man's a goddamn good American. He's a true cowboy. According to Studio 92. Yeah, bitch, 40 years ago. Brian Ventura loves to face Kevin Brown. Nolan Ryan did it the right way. He hates to face Tom Gordon. He did it the right way. Nolan Ryan did it the right way. His hobbies include golf, fishing, and movies. His favorite singers are Garth Brooks and John Cougar. That's cool. Ben. That's the set that has that badass Steve Lake card with his parrot. We'll show it right here. <laughs> What a dumb baseball card. Oh my god. His favorite actors are Bill Murray and Kurt Russell. Kurt Jack Russell played minor league baseball. Jack McDowell is his, his closest friend. Jack McDowell flipped off the fans at Yankee Stadium during a home game when he was a Yankee. Blackjack. He did. He's, yeah, not, he's, not the, he's not in the game anymore either. Yeah, they dropped those guys. A couple of them was weird. All right. Dogs are staring at us. We had a quesadilla. Dang, quesadilla. Um, we opened some cards and enjoyed a lot. Pedro. Jeff McNeil. Jeff McNeil. All right. Chrome mug, hot sauce. This has been ATG Kitchen. Welcome back. Welcome back. That quesadilla looked delicious. It was, it was delicious. It was us eating it. Sargento cheese. Yeah. And some tortillas. Tasty. Um, Birds of the week. Yeah. Bunch of birds coming in. There's Cap and some pigeons coming live from Colorado. Turf bird. Turf bird. Bird turd. Maple and him out on a walk with what apparently are ibises. They look like small storks or pelicans, but without without the pelican gobbler. Ibis. I b i s is what he said. Looking good. Um, yeah, I saw a crow at McDonald's. We wasn't eating McDonald's. We stopped to uh, get some Cokes at Mapco because we had our, me and your mother it had been eating pretzels. Pretzels. So I needed some nibblers. Crunching them up. Um, we finished up the regular season. We did. Here are the playoff seeding bracket. The number one seed Chart. goes to the Sauce Boss, who's taking on the number eight seed, Computer A's. Computer A's, led by, <clears throat> I don't know who's on that team. I don't know. Doesn't matter. The number two seed goes to Jordan, and the taking Brewers. on the, uh, the Phils, Computer Phils, who are the seventh seed. That's the all-catchers team. The Phillies are? I think so. Good luck. Yeah, Jordan. The number three seed goes to... Padres and myself taking on the Expos, who are the number six seed. And then the number four seed goes to Big Ken and his beautiful bottles of ranch, who are taking on the number five seed, Colin. Taking on his brother. Yes. In a series. Battle to the death. See who the supreme brother is. Are they twins? No. Because no, one's so. older. I don't think so. But a twin can be older than his sibling, so maybe they are twins. I don't know. It's a mystery. So mystery the sounds. twin brothers versus each other to see who goes moves on. Ooh. So yeah, playoffs are free to play right now. Yeah. Best of three every series. Teams are not locked. No free reign. Do whatever. Forever. Do whatever you got to do with yeah. your within your division. We will get that rolling and wrapping up, and then we'll figure out another one. Maybe. Uh, Another season, or maybe we do a short, couple inning smash ball. I wouldn't be trying out smash ball. Just no cap, just use whatever. No cap. 
pick. You can do the, we can do the division thing. You can just do no cap or whatever, uh, and just smash the I'd hell out no of some cap. balls. Yeah. Can you do two innings? I don't know. If I you think that's what we did last time. Was two was innings? It? I think that'd be perfect. Two or three <laughs> innings. Maybe three. Smash them balls. Maxed out sliders. Play at Coors. Yeah. yeah. See how far the homers can mm -hmm. go. Use anybody, <sighs> any card, any division. Stadium creator. Stadium Creator. It's a real thing. Finally. And what did you get? I bought a PlayStation. Five. Three. You got a five coming. We do have a five coming. Yeah. You won the Walmart lot. I did. You gotta wait till April. Maybe. I've seen some people who have who got it the same day. I did. Yeah. Uh there's updating. It's supposed to get to where they are located in like two weeks. That's cool. Maybe you'll get it. So yeah. So we'll the word that. is that Walmart posts their shipping, preparing whatever, like, far yeah. out, just in case it takes forever. Far out, man. Far out, bro. Far out, Whoa, bro. banana bucket. Yeah, I can't know if I can open it with his hand. Oh, hands are jacked up. Why didn't you use your other hand? Well, because my peel hand is the right one. Smack that banana out of your hand. Bananas are crazy. Bananas are crazy. It's a weird fruit. It's a weird fruit. They taste good. They do taste good. Make the bread out of them. Make your lobster. Slather them in peanut butter. You get kind of rotten. You gotta let them get rotten before you make the banana bread. Yeah. Mmm. What else you know? WBC. Anything? Oh, yeah. What's going on in the WBC? Well, the WBC. I took the time, downloaded a bunch of roster, uh, unis, logos. What's up, Nova? Put that shits together on the team's WBC file. Put it all computer control and played the USA games. Um, it's fun. It's kind of hard, but... Um, Getting slaughtered by teams like well, Belize and... No, Bahamas. I'll beat their ass, but Cuba can smash some balls. Well, it's pesky Cubans. It's shaking out. Italy's doing real good. They got Pirate Mike. Jordan and Saucy are on Germany. That's cool. Cooper and Tiger are on Spain. Me and you are with France. Cooper's had some wonderful clips. Cooper has had some good clips. This dog's eating banana peel. Doing the one Soto shuffle thing. And Colin with the Netherlands. But starting to be some gaps shaking off between the good teams. And I saw, I think it said the DR is 67 and 18. Yeah, it's a fun, and it's a fun one to play. the USA is around there too. Splat. Put this up on the roof. Maybe the crows will come. Maybe they will. Maybe the crows will come. Send us the crows. Come crows. I'm gonna have to get that off the roof because it's gonna get rotten. It is gonna get rotten. It'll turn into jerky. Oh, banana jerky. Yeah. Like that snake that one threw on the roof. Let's dance, Ladybird. This has been ATG Weekly. This has been ATG Weekly. Tune in next week for wrestling. Tuna next week. Tuna yeah, lots of wrestling next week. Tuna wrestling next week. Tuna wrestling. And we bring you the finest fish slapping. Ready for my checkup. Slap the fish. Slap the fish. Gonna check up Wednesday. Maybe. Oh see a swordfish. Or a shark. Swordfish is a shark. A shark. Done it. A large fish with a pointy teeth and a fin. A shark. The teeth are bouncing.